we are back. So, we got another extended um, little dungeon thing to do this time. Once again, as per usual, I am using the strategy guide for the game by Brady Games. It kind of helped me know where things are, like how many missions I have, like how, how the structure this is going to be, and how many what, how long uh, a thing might be. So, looks like My system's gonna have a dragon on the outside of the level. It's probably gonna want magic for, uh, be a wizard for that. Inside, there's some dragoons, a Terra Knight. So this one's gonna be a two part quest. So, a whole bunch of dialogue here. Here we go. Full 12 this time. All right. Um. Everett there. Spread you out a little bit. back because that's a little more range. Isleton there. Oh, this is like, a, I got to bring a full allotment of people. Okay, let's do... Dina. Let's bring Ban for the additional magic file power firepower. They need it. Over here, he's on the roof. It's in blood. What? The wall is there? Ice, are you all right? I can look after myself. I can see that. You, after him, I'll deal with these. I'll avenge my lord. Four Balbatos! Alright, so, objective is to kill her. Is to drop her. Do they have any ads? Okay, she does have ads will show up as we kill enemies. Oh hey, we have a we have one of the first um D, &D retro clones in the battlefield. Nice. So probably what we're gonna wanna do 
rather than going straight across. Is just head this way. Or at least send Primer Force this way. I should buy a second archer. Oh well. of Kagestan, lay down your arms and surrender. The clans do not wish to see you continue this fight, nor do they wish to see you dead. Don't throw away your lives. Join us in rebuilding this land. Empty words. A Galgastani does not fool so easily. Since engaging in combat only uh, it ups my weapon skills, but doesn't necessarily um, gain me additional XP or job points as it does in Final Fantasy Tactics. If I'm lucky, they'll press their attack in this direction. Magic leaf, nice. Yep, okay, so Gildora. So target you, and you are holding your position. I didn't expect this plan to work so well. Our plan was like, hey, we're just going to attack right across the bridge, which normally would be like a bad idea. But no. It turns out everyone else is like, no, clearly they're not going to attack across the bridge. They're going to cut around the side. So they're now moving into position where once I get actually able to over to protect the to target these guys, the only people who are in position to fight me directly are going to be squishier characters. Now some of these guys are pretty high DPS.
All right, so far so good. We're not close enough to zap anybody yet. That's like 20. Twenty-six. Ah, oh, that's worth it. From that beast device, will the wheezing, raging blizzard bends, winds lay waste to the weak? I'm not in range yet. Attack, let me just preempt for now. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the show, please like and subscribe. I also consider backing my Patreon. Patreon backers get episodes up to one week early of this show and any future Let's Plays. Also, please consider backing my coffee. Uh, toss me a few bucks, also helps support the show, and it's not a monthly obligation or anything like that.